old Japanese woman watching her play with the buttons on the toilet. <laughs> oh. <laughs> Okay, let's go. Are you excited? Uh, yeah, yeah. I'm looking forward to seeing what it's got to offer. I like your outfit, by the way. Oh, thank it's so you. so cool. Where thank did you get it? Uh, this is from ACDC Rag in Harajuku. Oh, nice. Yeah, it was my little treat to myself. Yeah, so. it looks really cool. Thank you. <laughs> oh my gosh, it's scary. Oh, hello. hello. <laughs> Oh my gosh, look at that afternoon too. We, we got them. Oh. Oh. Oh, we can watch YouTube on our robot. Wait, Oh what? wow! That's amazing! Wait, what's the smap part? Hold on. Is that the band? What are you going to have? I'm going to have some sparkling wine. Sparkling? Aww. Konnichiwa. Konnichiwa desu. Oh! The Myra Nandes guy. That's cute. Okay. So cute. Peppa, Nihongo Jozu. Ureshi. Peppa, Nansai desu ka? Boku wa 2014 nen yumare desu yo. Hi everyone, I'm here, Beth Japan, and I'm here with my friend M. Hello. And we are in uh, Peppa Pala in Shibuya in the Tokyo Plaza. So we are in a robot cafe. Yeah. Uh, so this is my friend M. She's from England and she's actually from my hometown, but we met in Japan. Which is kind of it's wild. So, but... Yeah, so wild. Mm -hmm. So our parents are friends, and yeah. uh, your mum posted on Facebook saying that. Uh, I was moving here. That she was moving here, and then my mum was like, "Oh, my daughter's in Japan as <laughs> yeah. well." Uh, so yeah, and then uh, we have a lot of similar interests as well, which is yeah, great. Yeah. So good, sounds good. Kanpai. Kanpai. Hot. <laughs> it tastes good. Okay, so one thing I wanted to ask, because I know I, I've been here for seven years, so I've kind of gotten used to everything, and I can't really remember all the things that seemed strange to me. Hmm. Um, I guess one of them is a robot cafe. <laughs> oh. What? Oh wait, What's wait, that? wait, we're What's interrupted the... by something much interrupted. more important. Whoa! Fries, fries, fries. <laughs> fries, 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 fries. Arigato! Arigato! Ooh! Ooh. These look nice actually. Yeah. Oh look! So they're literally like a battered, battered chips. They're deep fried. Mm. Oh, they're very... oh, they're good. Oh wow! Mm. These are amazing. I almost regret not buying my own. <laughs> so, <laughs> before we got distracted by the chips, <laughs> um, I just wanted to like talk about some of the strange things in Japan because yeah, yeah. obviously like uh, robot cafe and everything, a lot of people think Japan is very futuristic. Um, how do you feel about that? Like, Do you think Japan's really futuristic or what was your impression? In some ways it has things that are more like technologically advanced but I wouldn't say at all it's more futuristic it is behind in a lot of things LGBTQ yes. rights yeah. is a big one yeah um, yeah still behind in that yeah um, and then like behaviors and things some mm. things are much more behind but like yeah you get like the robot cafes and things as well yeah. so yeah. it's kind of really an interesting mix of like these really old like, yeah beliefs and traditions yeah. which have been both Americanized and yeah. modernized as mm. they allowed other countries in after like exactly. the major restoration and that stuff. Exactly, right. And then it's just really interesting to see how Japan as a culture and a yeah. country has evolved compared to other countries. Yeah, yeah. So I, I, it's I like, agree yeah. with you, yeah. Yokoso Shin Takamangahara. You know, there are a lot of strange things in Japan, and I, I often feel like, oh, only in Japan. You know? Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's the thing I'm saying all the time, like, you'd only find this in Japan. Yeah. For example, um, 
Like, there's some very unusual uh, interests in Japan that are yeah, okay, yeah. like a. <laughs> it's a very conservative society. And then you'll see like these weird kind of like um, things pop up, like um, hostess clubs or yeah. maid cafes or some weird kind of love hotel. Yeah, um, I, I think it all links back to overworking culture. Yeah. Because when people overwork, they have no time to form relationships, mm. to explore any kind of area of that themselves privately. Mm. So it kind of is their only escape, like, is yeah. to, like, these not Conversions. as... <laughs> I, d I don't know what I'd want to call it. So, these, I guess, different ways of doing it. Have you gone to any of those? No, because I'm too, too scared to go by myself, in full honesty. Like, one mm. of the places I really want to go to is Swallowtail. What's that? Which is a butler cafe. Oh! It, you can't film in there, mm. but it's like, it's quite expensive, but like they literally like treat you like a princess for the entire time, like proper butlers. I really want to go. Is it like a host, host cafe? No, it's, I don't know, it's, it's more like a maid cafe, but they're like proper butlers and they like serve Are they you men tea. or women? Yeah, men. Oh! Swallowtail, I, I kind of want to go, but to go by myself. I will go with you. I will um, go with it's you. It's in Ikebukuro. Yeah, I've been wanting with you. to go to Ikebukuro for ages. Wow. So. Um, so, another thing I know that we have in common mm -hmm. is video games. Yes, yes, and definitely. And Pokemon. Yes. So, uh, what are your favourite video games, actually? Gosh, I have a lot. Um, I mean, when I was a child, it was all Sonic the Hedgehog, right? <laughs> yeah, because, you know, yeah. so when I was little, but I've, I've, I like most Nintendo games as well, mm. so like Mario, Splatoon, which is huge here. I also like things like the Ryu Gakotoku series. I or love in, it. Or in English, Yakuza series. Yakuza series, yeah. Um, When you play the game, it's actually very similar to Kabukicho. Well, it, yeah. Well, it's because they use real life references. Yeah, and I um, was so surprised. No, the one that got me, well, it didn't get me because I knew it would be really accurate, was I went to Yokohama and I mm. purposely went to Yamashita Park because that's in the game. Yeah, 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 yeah. I was literally taking pictures and being like, oh, this is where these characters have this conversation. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Hmm? Pokemon! Pokemon. <laughs> Gotta catch them all! <laughs> What's your favourite Pokemon? Um, I have several favourites. Okay, uh, if, you, if you could be a Pokemon yourself, which one would you want to be? Man, that one's difficult. I like, like, I genuinely like the Pokemon Sylveon. Yeah. It's so pretty and yeah. it's really cute. Yeah. I know which, which one I want to be. Which one do you want to be? Ditto! Because then I can beat all of them! Oh no, you just got... No, no. <laughs> then you got to say, I want to be Mew. Because then you get the transform ability, but you're also an adorable pink cat thing. Yeah. Have you seen the Pokemon movie? Which one? The one with um, Pikachu, the detective. Oh, Detective Pikachu? Yeah, I saw mm. that in cinemas. Yeah. And then the ditto, when it changes into like other Pokemon, it looks yeah. evil. Because its eyes are just black, right? Oh yeah, there's the little yeah. dots. I the little dots, it's like freaky, but I love mm. it. So I wanted to show you some of my favourite Pokemon cards that I got recently. Do you want to see the case I've got these in? It's an Appleton oh, little box. Oh, wow! I got it from the Pokemon Centre. It had little apple pies in it. That's cute. I've been keeping Pokemon cards in here. Oh wait, I brought I brought these ones specifically because I wanted them. I bought some as well. Akihabara. These were, they weren't that expensive because um, okay. they're not super wanted ones. But yeah. I would need them for my actual game deck. I got Metagross and Metagross V Max. Um, yeah. Because I really wanted them for my genuine deck. Which is in so, English, but like, whatever. Some of these are my favourite ones, I will show you. Oh, you got Beldum. I don't know if you can see that, hopefully you can. Then you've got Eevee. These cards are beautiful, the artwork on oh, them. Oh, they're full arts, those are like expensive yeah. ones. And then, 
This one, I was so oh shocked when I pulled this. Oh my gosh. Look what I got. Gold Mew. That's I honestly weird. had a heart attack when I pulled it out of the deck. And I, I was bet. like, oh my gosh, I can't believe I got this. Yeah, I've got one glittering gold I didn't even buy it. I actually pulled it from a deck. And I was That's so shocked because a lot of my rare Pokemon cards I have actually bought. Hmm. Um, Medicari. <laughs> But. Today, I have a special gift. Oh my gosh. I have <sighs> some Pokemon cards. Oh, we'll just get a really garbage so. ball. <laughs> <laughs> so, which one do you want to open? Oh, I'll do that one. Okay, I'll open this one. A Cyndaquil. Poliwhirl. Yeah, Poliwhirl. Oh, I got nothing good. <laughs> a pull card. Oh. <laughs> Let's hope this one's better. What's this one called again? Magnemite. Magnemite. What? Magnemite. Magnemite. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. And then I'm we got this one. Well, that's a nice one. And then this one. And you know what? I'll give it to you. Are you there sure? There you go. You my sure? gift to you. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> Um, oh, tell them the story of what happened in the no, toilet. No, no, I, I know the story. It's been told once. It, it, we're past it now. Okay, so the toilets in Japan have 5,000 buttons because they have loads of bidets. And normally I'm fine with it, absolutely fine. But this one place, the writing had rubbed off. Yeah. So I couldn't even translate it. And so, the thing is, like, the buttons are usually in a sim similar location. You just didn't know which location because you haven't got yeah. used to so, like, it. Yeah, so, like, I could clearly tell which ones were B-Day buttons. But yeah. then there's a few words, like, it could be any one of these. Yeah. But if I press the wrong one, I'm getting a face full of water. Yeah. So I had to run from the bathroom and quickly grab you and go, please help me. And um, <laughs> I had to go to the toilet and flush it for her. <laughs> yeah. But you, you had to do in the a, same. In all fairness. Happened to you. In all so. fairness, it did happen to me. So... Um, if my friend's watching, she will actually know that she had to come to the toilet as well and flush it for me when I first came to Japan. Mm. Um, you know my mum, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. We were in Shinjuku in the department store yeah. and we were in the toilet. And then I was waiting outside. Mm. My mum comes out, grabs me and yeah. she's like, go, 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 go. And I'm like, what, what? So we go mm. and then I'm like, what happened? She went, I was sat on the toilet and I was playing with the buttons and I was, you know, oh, this feels nice, the bidet and, yeah, you know, yeah, yeah, trying yeah, yeah. everything. And then she didn't notice that when she turned around, the door hadn't locked properly and there was some old Japanese woman watching her play with the buttons on the toilet. <laughs> oh. Wait. If your mum's watching, I'm so sorry you had to go through that. I am so sorry. Um, another thing, and anyone in Japan, I would definitely recommend doing this. It mm -hmm. is actually really fun. Yeah. So, um, when my mum was uh, first in Japan, she said to me that, you know, oh Beth, you know, I want to go toilet. How do I ask where the toilet is? And I, was, uh, I said to her, okay, well, you just go to that lady over there and tell her, Uncle Shitai, Uncle Shitai. Tell her that. So my mum goes to the waitress and she goes, Simasen, Simasen, Unko Shitai, Unko Shitai. Oh and the woman God. was like, uh, okay, and took That's it to the so toilet. Me. And so basically that means in English, I need a poop, I need to poop. I so think that's mean. <laughs> my mum came back and we were laughing so hard. And she was like, why are you laughing? And I was like, I, I, said, I told her what she said and she ran to the, she ran to the waitress and said to her, no, no one goes die, no, 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 no one goes die, no one goes die. And the waitress was like, oh, don't do this, don't do this, she got an eye, she got an eye, she got an eye. She was like, don't worry about it, it's natural. Yeah. And it made my mum even more embarrassed because she couldn't even explain to her that she didn't mean what she said. Yeah. Actually, someone did it to me and that's how I got the idea. Oh. So I wanted to have the same drink again, which is Okawari. Mm -hmm. But I asked my, my friend, how do I get another drink? And they say, oh, say to the barman, Yari Tai. I was like, I said to him, Yari Tai. And he went, what? And I shouted, Yari Tai. And then like people were looking at me and I went, 
what did I just say? say oh and no. I was like, what did I just say? And he, he was just like giggling saying, <laughs> you asked him, you said you want to have sex with him. <laughs> Oh no! I, honestly, I, I had to leave. I, I was bet. red in the face. I was mortifying. so embarrassed. Yeah, mortifying. <laughs> when did you know you were asexual? Oh gosh. Um, or was it just always been? I don't, I don't think I had a word for it for a long time. Yeah. Or like, because like growing up and things mm. like. Always like whenever anybody was like, you know, oh, one day you'll get a boyfriend. I was never that interested. Yeah. Or like when I was, it was only ever, ever in a romantic sense. Yeah. I've never been interested really on the other side. Or like, yeah. I've like always like the the traditional viewpoint of wait till after marriage never sat as weird with me. Yeah. And I think that's because I like when I grew up to a teenager and think I had romantic crushes on celebrities, but never have I ever looked at someone and thought get it yeah so I think it's just something that once I learned the terminology I learned yeah. I'm on that asexual spectrum yeah somewhere yeah exactly where I don't know but I know mm. that I'm within that area yeah so. and you don't necessarily need to know do you it's, no, it's just exactly. go with your feeling I mean I know we have a lot of labels for things but just going with your gut feeling yeah exactly basically. so it's yeah. just like look if one day something happens it happens if it doesn't mm. it doesn't but for mm. now it's like I'm just not interested in yeah. anything like that. Yeah. I just want to have a fun time with my friends. Just have fun. Yeah, exactly. With me. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> so, uh, yeah, if you have any recommendations for my friend Em, please let us know. She's only been here for two months. So, uh, you know, I, I can't think of everything off the top of my head, um, but I'm trying to uh, take her to different places and give her recommendations. But if you have any recommendations for her, places to go, things to eat, please, please, please put it in the comments. Uh, I'd appreciate yeah, it. Yeah, you. she does read the comments, so she'll read and um, reply to some of them. You are going to go to You are going to go to Yeah, thank you for watching. Let me know, if you were a Pokemon, what would you be? So I'm, I want to know what people think they are. What, yeah, what yeah, Pokemon do they identify what as? What kind of Pokemon are you? How do you do the things you do? <laughs> what? How do it's, you do? it's from a song. Oh, okay. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so yeah, thank you for watching. Check out this robot cafe. It's very nice. They do afternoon tea as well, like the cake things as yeah, well. Yeah. So uh, definitely recommend these potato chips. They're really nice. Mm -hmm. Chips in England. Chips. But yeah, not fries. Yeah, chips. But this is the uh, first video of the series of Foodie Fridays. Ooh. So next week, you'll be jo I'll be joined with another person. Uh, it'll be a man this time. Ooh. And I will also ask him about his experiences in Japan. Oh, nice. So I will see you next time, next Friday on Foodie Fridays. Bye. Bye. So you can get these. Oh, so cute! <laughs> Sayonara!